One thing that I wish I knew when I was 18 was that the world is not the place that you're taught that it is. Uh, I guess what I'm trying to say is you feel like the people that you meet are supposed to be experts at their professions uh, are actually experts. So uh, Doctors are supposed to have all the answers about your medical conditions. Uh, lawyers and any other professionals are supposed to be experts at what it is that they do. And then I've realized as I've gotten older that this is definitely not the case. Uh, so what I would suggest is that you, if you're younger at least anyways, to just take my word for this and don't be afraid to ask questions. So. The reason that a lot of these people, I believe, are not experts in their field is because we as human beings tend to be very scared and apprehensive about asking questions uh, whenever we think we're going to be ridiculed or made fun of. And my advice would be to not be afraid to ask questions because unless you ask, you're never actually going to know these things. You're never going to gain that knowledge. and expertise to be able to help people that you really need to help um, as a doctor or as a lawyer or as whatever your profession is um, so one of the things that I wished I knew when I was 18 was that this is actually the case uh, I had a professor a long time ago tell me that you've been in school for a very long time if there's something that you don't know you shouldn't be afraid to ask because it's not your fault that you don't know You've had teachers for a very long portion of your life, at least as long as you've been going to school. And it's their job to educate you. It's their job to tell you all these things in the world that you haven't been exposed to yet. So if there's something that you don't know, don't be afraid to ask. Just jump right in. Because nobody's expecting you at 18 or 25 or hell, even 30 to be a complete genius or to be a complete expert in any particular field. So. My advice is to ask questions, don't be scared. Um, and on a similar but not completely related topic, I would also like, I also realize that people are all very similar. Um, most people are experiencing the same emotions, have the same fears, have the same desires, and to treat other people as if they're different than yourself or that you're somehow unique. Not that people aren't unique and not that you're not unique, but most people have a very similar underlying kind of nature to them. And in order to feel more content and more productive, more at ease with yourself, don't think of yourself as an island. Don't think of yourself as being different than other people. So you may see somebody acting in a particular way. Don't just assume that that person is that way because that's what the persona, the persona that they're trying to give off because going through various experiences with people who are going through similar experiences I've found that almost everybody has the same desires and fears and concerns and talking to people about these things uh, so sort of like asking questions being willing to put yourself out there and voice your insecurities or your the questions that you have about particular things uh, is only going to make you realize how m similar you are to other people um, and make it easier for you to engage with the world in general anyways. So that's if I, if I knew anything when I was 18 that I don't that I know now that I didn't know then that's probably one of the biggest ones that I would have wished that I knew.